I am now going to show you how to use the myo tool to treat the thoracic spine. Wonderful technique, and I should say this is probably the home run hitter of all of the techniques on the myo tool. This is what creates the beautiful fact that the myo tool can mobilize specific joints of the spine by lifting with the handles. Go ahead and lift up. So we're going to position it right in the middle of the spine. So meaning the center knobs are on the left and right of the vertebrae. She knows she's in the right spot. You can't make a mistake because when she starts to lift, it has a comfortable feel. and You can feel the center knobs lifting and rolling up as it comes into the paraspinal muscles and mobilizing that specific rib or that, in this case, that specific thoracic vertebrae. So then she moves to the next level, just moves up half an inch, and she's creating a nice mobilization technique. Again, the only self-treatment tool on the market that allows you to do specific spinal joint mobilizations. Now, of course, we're working through a lot of the muscles, the fascia, to create this movement. But once that myo tool comes up to this position, that's sitting about an inch and a half up off of the treatment table. So that is creating intentional bone movement. Now, let's say she has a rib problem. She's had a flu, cough, or sneeze, and has pain. We slide it to the side of pain. Let's say she has some pain wrapping around underneath the breast here, and it hurts to have a deep inhalation or exhalation or cough. She moved the two center knobs so they are on the left, and as she goes to lift, she feels it specifically moving that rib. That may be the sensitive sore spot. So to check to make sure we're on that, she's going to go ahead and move it about an inch lower to grab the rib below and say, well, yeah, that feels okay. She'll put it back on the sensitive spot. Ow, that hurts. Move it, the rib above it, and find out that, hey, that feels okay. So again, she's going to find the most painful segment, or in this case, the most painful rib, go to the rib, find that rib that's painful, and then she's going to work it. She may, it may be so painful that the only thing she can do is really just that little bit, just gently moving. But again, it's using the myo tool to do a self-treatment technique very gently, paying attention to her pain, if she's doing the right technique with the right amount of force, that pain scale, maybe a 4 or a 5 out of 10, should drop to a 1 or a 2 out of 10 in very short time, 20, 30 seconds. Thank you.